As part of a pilot project, the town of Westport in County Mayo received funding from a government initiative called the Smarter Travel Programme. Often greenways are built outside of towns and cities for tourism. But here in Westport, it's different. They're built for the everyday use of the local community. I want to find out if this made an improvement to the lifestyles of the locals. Hi, Eva, how are you? Hi, Lara. It's so you? nice to meet you. Nice to meet you Thank too. Thank you so much for coming out today. And tell me what the greenways are. Well, greenways are off-road cycle tracks um, and walkways. So they're off-road and they link up housing estates and schools. And uh, they're really good because there's no traffic on them. So it makes it safe routeways for the people of a town to travel. One of the schools is about 70% that would cycle and scoot to school. So they can literally leave their houses, go onto the greenways on their bicycles and cycle to school without meeting any traffic or cars. And what about then the long-term health benefits of this active travel? Yeah, I suppose it's trying to get in exercise into your daily routine, not have it something separate, that's something else you should do when you come home from work. Um, we're all really tied for time, our lives are very, very busy. So if you can uh, fit in physical activity on your route to school, on your route to work, um, that means you're freer in the evenings um, to do other stuff as well. So it's all about uh, being physical and mobile all day long, not just um, for a half an hour in the evening. Eva, I feel like I kind of have to see this for myself. Is there anything we can see? Yeah, right here we can get going. OK, perfect, great, thanks a lot. Experiencing the greenways around Westport really shows how good infrastructure can make a big difference to people's lives. More and more children are using these new greenways to walk, cycle and scoot to school in a safe and relaxing environment. Simon Wall was the architect behind the Greenways. So Simon, we profess to have bike paths and bike tracks all over this country, but a lot of them are just plain and simple not used. How do you get people to use your infrastructure? By providing quality greenways, the vast majority of our greenways are segregated from roads and they're going through nice green settings and interlinking housing estates and they're very practical because they follow desire lines linking existing residential areas. So the usage is not only practical, but also the fact that the way they're designed independently of traffic, their use is desirable as well. Secondly, the surface is tarmac, so it's, it's available for multi-use, be it on a roller blade, a wheelchair, a skateboard, cycling or walking. It has a multitude of, of, of use capabilities. And of course, an important component is that the greenways are illuminated with LED lights into the evening. So that increases the usage, particularly in the winter months where people are less inclined to get out on the greenways and start exercising. Is this something that we can expand, that we can bring to other towns and cities around Ireland? I think it's a really good template nationally that can be rolled out around the country. And our experience that we've, we've had as pioneers in terms of greenways in, in, in Westport, I think that experience can be shared nationwide. And do you think it's worth rolling this out? Do you think it's worth making this a big scheme? Definitely. The benefit Greenways have afforded to the town of Westport has, has been tremendous in terms of circulation from place to place and not using the motor car, but also in terms of the quality of life and social and recreational use in terms of cycling and walking has benefited the town tremendously physically and has a knock-on effect of a mental well-being within the town. The benefit has been immense. While the Westport Greenways have been a great success, Sadly, projects like these are a rarity. Public investment in this kind of user-friendly infrastructure is tiny. So it's unlikely that we'll see more projects of this quality in the near future. It's unfortunate, because if we invested more in projects like these now, the significant health benefits would save a huge amount of money in the longer term.